President Moon Jae-in has started this three-day visit to Thailand to attend the ASEAN summit. Coming just weeks before Korea is hosting a very special summit with the regional bloc, President Moon will work to cons consolidate backing for his peace drive on the Korean peninsula. We start off with our Park hee who is travelling with the president. President Moon Jae-in travels to Bangkok on Sunday to attend the annual ASEAN summit, where he will focus on gathering support for his peace efforts on the Korean Peninsula and this month's South Korea ASEAN special summit in Busan. Through the ASEAN-related summits, President Moon will explain our government's efforts on various issues, including the Korean Peninsula. He will also gather ASEAN's continued support for the success of the 2019 South Korea ASEAN Special Summit and the first South Korean Mekong Summit between November 25th and 27th. After a gala dinner on the first day, hosted by this year's ASEAN Chair Thailand, the president will attend a series of multilateral discussions. On Monday, President Moon attends the ASEAN Plus 3 Summit involving the 10 ASEAN nations and South Korea, Japan and China. Moon will emphasize the need to build a stronger partnership for sustainable development, which is the agenda of the international conference. President Moon will further discuss sustainable development over a special luncheon. Also attending will be UN Secretary General Antonio Guterres and IMF Managing Director Kristalina Georgieva. Explaining the efforts made by South Korea to achieve the UN sustainable development goals, the president is keen on elevating the country's position as a responsible middle power. The East Asia Summit will be held the same day. Also joined by neighboring partners U.S., Japan, China and Russia, President Moon will explain his administration's efforts to establish peace and denuclearization on the Korean Peninsula. And discussing transnational crime, the president will highlight Korea's contribution to addressing security issues. The role of ASEAN has become all the more important following the cancellation of the APEC Summit in Chile. The event comes amid rising tension between Seoul and Tokyo over historical and trade issues and a deadlock with North Korea. Although there will be no bilateral summits, the South Korean president will actively participate in the multilateral discussions to seek diplomatic solutions with the Southeast Asian nations. Japanese Prime Minister Shinzo Abe will also attend the ASEAN meetings, meaning President Moon and Abe could still meet on the sidelines. The Blue House says there is no scheduled one-on-one, -on -one, but anticipation still built around the possibility in hopes it will provide an opening for renewed dialogue. Park Hee-jun, Arirang News.